We are just a day away now for the main event of the Saratoga racing season. It's almost Travers Day, and with a look at what to expect for tomorrow, News 10 ABC's Lydia Colbita standing by live with our trackside report. Lydia. John and Elisa, it is the biggest weekend here for the track. We're talking the Travers Stakes. It's a day that packs in tens of thousands of people, and this weekend, it's the 145th running of the Midsummer Derby. If you're coming up here, you'll want to wake up early. Track opens at 7 a.m., and there will already be a crowd at the gates waiting to get in. Help things out a bit, the spa's adding even more picnic tables to the backyard for families. 50 of them were added today, in fact. In all, there are about 200 more tables than last year. And that's just a small part of the big effort to get the race course ready. Anticipating a crowd of anywhere between 45 and 50,000 people, we have more security. That we've spent a lot of money to enhance the TV, the sound system, uh, the dining areas to make this an even more enjoyable place for everyone. Outside of the facilities, the crews have been working feverishly to get the track ready for the horses, especially after all the rain in Saratoga just this past week. Ten horses running in the Travers, including the continued rivalry between Tonalist and Wicked Strong, which famously heated up in the Belmont Stakes. And it is not just the Travers. There are 14 races here tomorrow, including three stakes races. First race begins at 11.35 in the morning, and the Midsummer Derby, the big one, the Travers Stakes, set to start around 5.45. Reporting trackside, Lydia Colbita for News 10 ABC. John and Elisa, back to you.